the steadily growing population of tourists and visitors to our islands during the past five to ten years has also increased the demand for fresh produce, in particular fruits and vegetables. This demand has also brought about some challenges as farmers try to increase their use of inorganic pesticides and fertilizers to try and maintain or manage the level of pests uh, in their crops. At the same time, to try and maintain the level of nutrition in the soil in order uh, to maintain a high yield. Over the last four to five years, through our training programs, to make farmers more aware of the many benefits of organic pesticides, we have seen a 20% or even more in some cases of the use of organically based pesticides by our farmers. We continue to see this positive trend where more and more farmers are using organic and biological based pesticides. The Ministry also promotes the use of other methods of managing pests in crops, including adjusting of spacing, using machinery to manage weed problems, and also uh, hand weeding where possible, where farmers are able to utilize these means uh, which are uh, non-chemical. The Ministry together with the financial and technical support of the Food and Agriculture Organization of, the, of FAO was successful in implementing a project at enhancing crop production while at the same time improving soil resources management for sustainable livelihood. The project largely focused on improving soil resources management through increased use of organic matter, use of cover crops, and minimizing soil tillage. Farmers were trained on the importance of improving soil health in order to improve the tolerance or in order to increase the tolerance of their crops to pests and diseases. Currently, the Ministry is working on a project with FAO and also the Secretariat of the Pacific Community, a regionally based organization that works together not only with FAO but with other donor partners and other implementing partners on many agriculture projects. The current project will help us look into our legislation and how we can uh, improve our legislation to try and address uh, the current issues, in particular around the importation and use of pesticides, especially moving towards uh, looking at safer alternatives or alternatives based around uh, organic pesticides and biologically based pesticides. <laughs>